Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if your Windows computer is seemingly turning on by itself. So there could be several different reasons as to why Windows is turning itself on or off, perhaps waking up from sleep or standby mode even if you have already shut it down. So we're going to go through hopefully a couple of different methods on how to resolve the problem. First thing I would suggest doing would be to open up the star menu. Just left click on the star button one time. Type in control panel. Test match should come back with control panel here. Left click on that. Now you want to set your view by to large icons and then you want to go left click on power options. Then you want to go ahead and navigate over to change plan settings, the hyperlink, whatever net plan is selected as your currently selected one. Just left click on change plan settings next to that. And now you want to go ahead and left click on the change advanced power settings button. So left click on that. Now you want to go ahead and look for the sleep tree here. Expand that. So left click on the little plus sign after that. And then expand allow wake timers. So expand that one as well for setting here. You want to just left click inside setting and then change the drop down here. Left click on disable and then left click on apply and OK. And would hopefully be able to resolve the problem. So if you were having a task scheduler issue, like there was a task that's being scheduled to restart your computer or turn it on, shut it down, hopefully that would resolve the problem on that end. Another thing you could try would be to disable automatic restart. So if your computer crashed, your computer would likely also restart or make an attempt to restart after that. So we're going to disable that as well if that may be perhaps one of the issues you're having here. So we're going to go back, close out of the control panel, open up the start menu, type in system. Underneath settings, left click on the system selection. So don't click on system information, you want to just left click on the system button. When you get the classic control panel item, so you could also go back through the control panel and then go through system as well. So once you're on here, you want to go ahead and left click on advanced system settings on the left side. Now you want to go make sure you're on the advanced tab and now underneath startup and recovery, system startup, system failure, and debugging information, left click on settings. If it says automatically restart right here, just uncheck it and then left click on OK. Once you're done with that, close out of here. Another thing would be if your keyboard or mouse seems to be waking up your computer, I'm going to show you guys how to address that. So we would just start by opening up the start menu, type in device manager. Best match should come back with device manager, left click on that. So the first one we're going to go to is mice and other pointing devices. I'm going to expand that selection and then I'm going to go to my first mouse in here, right click on it and then left click on properties. So I'm in a virtual environment so it's not necessarily going to always show you everything that you guys might see but if there's a power management tab on here you want to just left click on it and then there would be an area underneath that says allow this device to wake up the computer. You would just uncheck that box and left click on OK. Same would go for keyboards as well, so double click on that. Again, if you had the tab, you just want to go left click on it and then uncheck the box to allow this device to wake up the computer. So pretty straightforward for that. So I would suggest restarting your computer. Hopefully that was able to address the problem you guys were having. And as always, thanks for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.